This is the new Dodge Dart. It's a replacement for the Caliber, and not only is it not a Caliber, it is, in one very big way, kind of an Alfa Romeo. It rides on an altered version of the platform that underpins the Alfa Romeo Giulietta. Alfa Romeo is currently scheduled to come back to the U.S. in 2013, but that's been pushed back and pushed back, and I got 20 bucks that says it gets pushed back again. That means for the foreseeable future, this is as close as you're going to get to buying a new Alfa Romeo in the U.S. It'll launch with two available four-cylinder engines, a 2-liter and a 1.4-liter turbo. They'll make the same 160 horsepower, but the turbo's 184 pound-feet of torque are going to be nearly 40 better than the naturally aspirated engines. It's got a lot of the features that people expect on a modern small car. There's shutters in the grille, closed for a cleaner aerodynamic profile and open up to allow more air through when you need to cool the engine down. And let's go inside and check out some of the features there. Inside, there's an available 8.4 inch touchscreen display here and there's a 7 inch screen right in front of me in the instrument panel. Got a uh, tilting and telescoping wheel. The mechanism on this car is a bit loose but it's probably pre-production auto show special. On paper and in person, looks a lot better than the caliber.